guys. So I'm waiting for Connor to get back. We're going to be leaving for Comic Con today. I'm super excited. Ready to go. He had to go into work. There's just been a lot of stuff that's been going on this morning. So I am packed. He's still late to pack. I want to apologize because I still don't have editing software on my computer yet because like my computer crashed so I haven't had time to do any editing. Um, I've been doing, there's a lot of midterm papers due, there's a lot of stuff going on. So I'm sorry guys. I'm going to bring you guys along to Comic Con because it's going to be really fun and exciting and yeah, so I'll see you guys there. how to get our tickets and we figured it out so we're here now but there's a lot of stuff I don't understand any of this this is not my thing but it's his birthday and I am enjoying it did you see something nothing is catching your eye it's been a long day with driving here can't buy it all true or can I probably not oh they have ribbons they're bows I love those. These guys are just selling like comics that came out Wednesday. It looked like they're exciting. Oh, there it is. My Look. Little Pony. Yeah. That's what I came here for. For My Little Pony? My Little Pony. That's the real reason why we're here. That's what got me to buy the tickets. Oh, we didn't walk in here, did we? I don't get it. Comics. They combine comics. That's clever. That is really clever, actually. to be sweet because we're on vacation and take me to a fancy restaurant and we just left because I couldn't understand anything on the menu and my social social anxiety kicked in and I started panicking so I was like let's leave it, the menu was like in Italian so we left it was a very nice restaurant it's pretty small they didn't have any seats so they sat us at the bar which already made me feel kind of awkward but I don't know it's just weird so now we're going to find a place that hopefully has their menus in English but I don't really know how that'll go. So. We'll see. These menus are not in English. I have no clue what to get. I don't know if this is a cultural thing. We're in North Carolina right now. This is not how I was raised to eat. But I have no <laughs> That lady is eating her pizza with a fork and a knife. I feel like I'm in an alternate universe. Like I genuinely feel that way. Listen, I the waitress came over here and I literally was like, "Do you have pizza that's just cheese?" <laughs> this is like an alternate universe. 
like, I feel so out of my element, like, I feel judged. Hard. There's like, we're, we're right in front of a window, so like, there's people standing outside waiting that are just watching me film this right now, so that's cool. But anyways, it's so loud in here. I was tempted to just like, eat at the hotel, but I don't know if our hotel even has room service. Huh? I don't know if our hotel even has room service. Yeah, why not? I have no idea. But anyway, I think I'll, I think I found something that I can actually eat because I'm so picky. But Mom. we shall see. Turner, he never listens to me when I'm vlogging. Sorry. talking about how bad I'm going to be. It'll be pretty comical. It, it'll be fun. It'll be funny. No, there was a point where I was like, you look straight at me. Where, right here? <laughs> the Enterprise is right there. So what was the what was the game that we played? Werewolves within. Werewolves within. We made it in time for panel, and we got food in the meantime too. So we're doing good. Yeah. Connor won. We played two rounds of the virtual reality game, and Connor won the last round. I don't know how he did, but he did. I just told the truth the entire time, which is probably my mistake. Maybe. I don't really know. What were you the first game? I was a watcher. Oh, yeah, maybe you don't need to hide that. No, I didn't need to hide either time, but. Yeah. It's just hard when you're the villager because you literally can't do anything but sit there and listen. At least with the watcher, I could like watch someone and figure out what they were doing, you know? The deviant couldn't do anything either. Yeah, it's like annoying when you have a role where it's like, oh, but the deviant, you get to know who the werewolf is. No, you don't. Oh. That, the, the thing, the turn cloak? Yeah. What I was, what I was the first game? Uh -huh. that, that one you didn't see. Oh, uh, okay. But. I don't know. <laughs> it was fun though, I liked it. A lot. I got one. You see an opportunity. Well, sometimes then help that creator by bringing it in as a license for the, the 
company to help do the, some of the production and, and help to pay some of the bills on that. And that's helped us do that. That's how we've done Zombie Tramp. It started out as a creator on the book, uh, and now it sells almost 15,000 copies in about a month. Uh, so, uh, Which is an insane number for indie comics, by the way. Um, a lot of uh, the reason that it stays off of people's radars is because there's so many variant covers that people are like really rabid about. So it doesn't actually look like it sells, but because you know it's spread out over five or six covers. But yeah, that book every month, it's it's huge. I didn't um, close out the vlog again last night, but that's okay because there's another day. Um, Kinda just tried to tell me that my dog looks like it's from Jersey, even though it's not. He said that it's in her, it's in her bark. Wombos. Eggs. Banana. I don't really know what that is, but it's some kind of meat. I don't really like it, so I'm probably not gonna finish it. I always forget how much you love toast. You just really like toast. Yeah? I don't know why he never talks. He only just nods and makes hand gestures. <laughs> okay. Bye, guys. I'll see you later. Don't really know what we're doing today yet. But we're definitely going to go to... Come, come. We're at Screaming though. There's a lot going on right now. We're outside taking a break. We just got out of a panel about um, finding God in comics. That was very interesting. And what else did we do? That's all we've done so far. We got a bunch of decals. I showed you guys that. So hopefully those are cool. Connor got a black cat poster that's inappropriate. I can't I can't I can't do anything about it. And we got some ornaments that are really cute. And I got a flash button. And what else? I got a Groot decal. He's so cute! What is his name? Who? The wizard. Gandalf. Gandalf, that's it. It's Mike Wazowski dressed up as Gan Gandalf, and it says, put that ring back where it came from, or so help me. And I think that's freaking hilarious. There's also a booth in there that I like a lot that's, um, it's, um, there's a booth that I really like called Comics, and it's spelled like C-O-M-I-X-E-D, and it's like all these like cool posters and pictures of um, different comic book characters like crossed over and with other comic books. So there's like a stormtrooper whose armor is in like the pattern of Spider-Man, and I think that that's really cool. This is the Jurassic, the Jurassic Park Jeep is also here, so that's cool. And now we're gonna go back inside with all the crowds and check out some more booths. It's gonna be super crowded. 
So we'll see you in there. That's a pretty waterfall. <laughs> the last panel um, it was a Marvel panel it was really cool we're leaving I'm using Connor's phone because mine is the storage is full as usual which is why I wish I had an actual vlog camera <laughs> we couldn't do everything that we wanted to obviously it's just insane they have like five different things happening at once and then you have to leave early if you want to be able to wait in line and there's just a lot of lines and a lot of picking and choosing what you want to do and it's just really difficult for us to fit everything in That's fun though. but yeah I think we I think we did good I think it's um I think we did a good job getting stuff in we got a lot of stuff I'll show you guys in the car I guess the ornaments we got and I'll show the posters and stuff that we got I may even just wait till we get home to do that so I'll show you a little bit of the things that we got Flash pen I got from my bear, Francis. Alright, I'll show you guys. We got some ornaments because Christmas is coming up. So we got this one is the Grinch. A Batman one. Because Connor loves Batman's. The reason I got um, a bunch of Flash stuff is because that's the only like superhero show that me and Connor have actually like sat down and we both genuinely like. There's some things 
that um I liked that he tolerated and that he liked that I tolerated but didn't necessarily like but the flash was the first thing that we found that we both genuinely enjoyed so we kind of binge watched that together okay so I'm gonna show you some posters some prints that we got this first one these first two are mine I don't know if I got another one I believe I did but I'm not sure so this first one is a Wonder Woman poster okay and then we have our flash this is um the show that we watch this is Barry and that's Dr. Wells and um reverse flash and the flash and I just like love this poster I think it's beautiful it's Harley Quinn and the Joker Psylocke so we have Black Widow Boba Fett Flying shooting things, and then Black Cat. Oh my god, this is a big purchase, it is limited edition, um, Spider-Man comic, it's a, um, it's signed and sketched by Chris McJunkin, um, it is eight, it is eight out of fifteen copies. It's like a blank copy that they release for artists to draw on. And here's the comics that I got. I got this because Christmas is coming up. This Walt Disney Christmas Parade comic. I read the first two. They're adorable. Like, they're literally just like the cartoons that I watched as a kid growing up. And similar to the Christmas stories that I like in Mickey's Once Upon a Christmas and Mickey's Twice Upon a Christmas. I saw an Action Lab panel. They were hilarious. Um, I thoroughly enjoyed theirs. I think theirs was my favorite panel that we saw while we were there. They're really funny, um, just really cool guys, and they let you, if you went to panel, you could get a free, um, graphic novel, so Connor got this one. They're really cool. They have, they also, um, told us about this game that we're gonna try called Miraculous, I don't know, it's not called Miraculous, it's called Throwdown, but they have a, sh um, series out, I think it's called a series, I don't know, called Miraculous, and I checked it out, and it's not really my style, so I didn't get it, but, um, I'm interested to find out what this game is about. Oh, this is my flash that I got, so I got another flash print. Uh, Scarlet Witch. And we have another Psylocke. I think that's all we have, really. We didn't buy that much stuff, but, um, I thoroughly enjoyed it. But thank you guys so much for watching, and please give this a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you guys in my next video.